Okay guys and gals, this is just a quick uh, demonstration and wind diagram of how the Nest Hello works. Now, um, for all non-electricians out there, the actual videos on Nest are very, very good. But I find here in the UK, they seem to be very orientated towards the US and US wiring and their types of uh, doorbell. Obviously in the UK, we tend to have completely different doorbells um, and different arrangements from battery to transformers and low voltage transformers. Uh, I just wanted to, to basically put a, use the Nest as an input, but switch my existing doorbell. Um, very, very simple. Uh, the chime connector does, does all the work, but um, I thought it might just help lots of people have out especially electricians on site who are asked to fit these uh, just with the connections so a little drawing here so okay we'll look at the wiring diagram first uh, basically i've used a um it's a one amp 24 volt output transformer so 240 in one amp out on a plug top so no mains wiring to be done with that uh shown on the wiring diagrams plug into tranny 240 in 24 out at one amp Two output cables, one cable goes to the chime connectors. These are the existing spring loaded connectors that come with the chime connector. I've actually cut them off in the uh, my example here, but uh, if you were to do that, you could just go straight in there. The second one comes out on the spring loaded connection, goes to the Nest push button. And from the other side, the push button, that would connect back to your transformer. And that's basically these two red wire and red and black wire. The red wire would have gone onto the spring connector straight to the nest. The other side of the spring connector goes to the cable which goes to the nest push button and then the return goes back onto the red and back back to the transformer. So when we switch the button operates the nest. The outgoing side of the uh, nest chime connector which is the ones with the two little hooks shown there go straight to the relay coil. I've used a 24 volt AC relay, obviously to go with the AC transformer, and gone straight onto the two coil connections with the output um, uh, from the Nest chime connector. Uh, when we switch the Nest, we would operate the relay and everything should work as it should. Just for, Just to show here, this is an existing battery uh, connection. I've used then the volt free contacts on the relay, so a common and a normally open contact on this relay. So when the relay energizes, it operates the existing um, door chime. All quite straightforward and simple. So if I press the button, relay operates, doorbell goes. Everything works as it should. Using this method, you could quite easily, as I've shown on this winding diagram, we have a relay, which is the Ralpol relay here. Uh, I've just shown it where, at the moment, I've got it connected directly onto the existing doorbell. But you could wire it in parallel with an existing bell push if you wanted to. So both would work together. It's entirely up to you. Or you can chop out the existing bell and wire these two cables straight in to the existing door chime connections. Uh, to make it as easy as possible. I'm doing a little bit more fancy uh, connections uh, in my home connection uh, just through the, um, I've got an old brass doorbell uh, from the 1930s which I'm operating and need a slightly longer run span on it. But I'm using this setup with this relay to operate the existing door chime. So yeah, I think that uh, about sums it up. So one more press. Job done. Hope this is some help. Cheers.